myo surgery in the United States is meant for patients who are high myopes or very nearsighted. It's another procedure that we can offer to patients who are generally not LASIK candidates. ICL is called implantable columnar lens, but you'll hear people say implantable contact lens, a lens implant within the eye to compensate or achieve vision without glasses. I would recommend ICL surgery for patients who are within the ages of 21 to 45. Once we realize that you're not a LASIK candidate, we start to gear toward, okay, what else can we offer? It probably involves two pre-op evaluations, and then the next step would be surgery. The nurses will get an IV started. Most of that time is kind of waiting for your eye to dilate so that I can safely implant the lens in your eye. Once you get brought into the operating room, anesthesia will give you some medication to relax you. Just enough to kind of get you relaxed and comfortable to tolerate the procedure. It takes about 10 to 15 minutes per eye. During ICL surgery, I use a lid speculum to hold open your eye so you don't have to worry about that. I do make a small incision, about one millimeter, and then I make a little larger incision, it's about 2.6 millimeters, and the lens is injected from that large incision. You'll see it open and fold out, and it's a fairly large lens, it's kind of rectangular. I took all four quadrants of the lens implant behind your iris, and it's placed right in front of your natural lens. After I'm done with that, most of the procedure is done. The recovery process for ICL surgery is using eye drops postoperatively, antibiotic drop and anti-inflammatory, no heavy lifting, probably for a week or two, and no swimming, um, and avoiding water and keeping everything clean. But otherwise, within a week of surgery, most patients feel back to normal.